guys in this video i'll be going to tell you how you can use workbench for executing an anon anonymous code okay so for this i'll be logging to my salesforce account first okay so i'm done logging in with my account and now i am log i'm there to the workbench url i'll be going to log in to my workbench account now so if you see here i'll just click on login with workbench now uh, this is the screen that you will learn to workbench so i've already told you you know the usage of soql query here so far in my last videos from on migration i've told you how to, you can do deploy and retrieve now in this session i'll be going to tell you how you can execute an anonymous code so for this you have to go to utilities and you have an option of apex execute okay so once you click on apex execute you will get this window now you can also increase or decrease the size of this window as per your convenience and so if you say the low category should be apex code and it should be a debug if you want to keep any debug statements basically in this code here so i'll keep the settings as apex code and local level as debug Okay, so I'll be going to tell you, let's say this is the script I have. So I have just prepared for this video. This is a simple script I have. So this is, I've just pasted the script here. And if you see, if I will execute it here. So what it is doing is a simple script. So what I'm doing here is I'm just querying all the accounts from my org and I'm telling first of all what is the count or how many records we have on the account object and further I'm displaying their account ID and account name which I am querying in the third line okay so if you'll see my result you can see here the number of account records are 12 and then you will get the account ID and account name for all these 12 records one by one so this is guys this is how we can use this option of apex execute using workbench okay do let me know in the comment section if you like this video and do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you guys thanks for watching my video we'll meet again